Some of the most famous movies to ever come out of Japan have revolved around samurai. And while there are plenty of well-known ones, there are some fantastic ones out there that don't get the love they deserve. To that end, these are some of the most underrated samurai movies. Samurai Wolf is a straight to the point blast of a movie, clocking in at just 75 minutes of more than enough action to keep things entertaining. Azumi is a fairly wild movie, but those who are patient will find plenty of sequences here to be immensely entertaining, particularly in the final act, when the action scenes escalate to wonderfully ridiculous levels. Anyone who comes across the betrayal while on the hunt for great action scenes will be pleased to find that this film is not one that will betray them. Though it moves slowly, Love and Honor is always quietly engrossing and very well made, rounding out a stellar samurai-focused thematic trilogy. The 47 Ronin is hugely impressive by the standards of the 40s, though it is admittedly maybe not the most exciting film to watch on this list, being a bit slow going at times. Like Love and Honor, The Hidden Blade unfolds at a steady pace and with an emphasis on drama and romance over non-stop action, taking an extra realistic approach to the time period it depicts. Part of a very long-running series, Zatoichi Darkness' ally is a grand finale to the titular character, a blind samurai wanderer who continually helps the downtrodden, which just based on that premise alone, pretty much anyone should be down to watch it. And finally, Samurai Assassin builds tension well and releases it when it needs to, providing engaging action at a steady pace and overall feeling like the best of both worlds when it comes to samurai movies, being focused on both historical drama and some rousing action for good measure. 